so sorry that you have to go through that. I mean, that is so terrible. Oh, time's up. Are you going to be paying with debit or credit? Wait, but I'm not finished. Yeah, your time is up. You got to go. I'm not, no. He broke up with me for the 17th time last night. Okay, okay, okay. Imagine something with me. Imagine that you just built a bridge. Now get over it. I told you last week not to get back together with him. And now you're broken up for the 17th time. How do you even date someone for 17 times? My life is just so hard. No, my life is really hard too. And I know that I'm supposed to be your therapist, but oh my goodness. Can we talk about me for a second? I mean, this is just so hard. So my dog drowned in a kiddie pool this past week. Wait, are you laughing at me? No, no, I'm laughing at um the starfish on the window back there. Sure you are. Okay, anyways, go ahead. Right, so my sister got slingshotted off of a roller coaster. <laughs> Are you seriously laughing at me? Oh That's it. I'm leaving. Wait, where are you going? You are so terrible. <laughs> Y'all, this mansion is so nice. Like, this party is about to be so good. Was that a gunshot? No, someone start the car because I am not doing this tonight. Y'all, there is a dead body on the floor. Did you kill them? No, I didn't kill them. Then who did? What do you want me to do? Ask them? Oh, wait, they're dead. Wait, someone died? Yeah, and we don't know who killed them. We should split up and search for clues. This is not Scooby-Doo. Um, don't disrespect Scooby-Doo. Scooby-Doo always figured out who it was. Did they die in the kitchen? No. Okay, so I'll be in there. You don't want to help figure out who it is? No, y'all look like y'all got it. I'll just let y'all do it. Just tell me when y'all find out. Oh my goodness, y'all. The door is open. Do y'all know what that means? Someone opened it. No, the murderer opened it. We don't know that. Well, yeah, but like... Y'all, I am not an investigator. What do y'all want from me? They are fools, all of them. So while they're in there trying to figure out who the murderer is, <clears throat> it's me, by the way. I'll just be swimming in this pool, okay? This is your captain speaking. The plane is going down. I cannot believe the plane would do this. I mean, that is so mean. Oh my goodness, right? Okay, everyone, the plane is going down. Just remember to stay calm and grab your oxygen. Uh, y'all, I think they just passed out. Oh my goodness, the plane is crashing. And what do you want me to do about it? Do I strike you as the pilot? I mean, I don't know what to do. Hey, Miss Flight Attendant, could you come over here? Is it an emergency? Yes, I was just wanting a bag of pretzels. Are you asking for food when the plane is about to crash? Yeah, but what does that have to do with me? I mean, I'm still hungry. Eww. The plane is going down. <gasps> Whoa, what happened? Did I just survive a plane crash? Yes. I am such an icon. My life was already pretty terrible before the plane crash, but this, this was my last straw. So I'm just going to go find a cave somewhere and just simply sit in it and cry. I lost my shoe. Wait, really? That happened to a character on Grey's Anatomy one time. Are you really talking about TV shows in the middle of the jungle? There is never a wrong time to talk about TV shows. We need to find food, water, and build a shelter. Why don't we just ask someone for help? Who do you want me to ask? Hello? Is anyone out there? Oh, no one said anything. Of course no one said anything. What did you expect? Tarzan to jump down from the trees? A tsunami! Wait, really? Yes! We should go swim in it! Are you crazy? We could die! No! Swimming in the tsunami is just like regular swimming, but with a little bit of spice. Everyone, get in the car. We have got to go. We won't be fast enough. Please, I drive like a NASCAR driver. That tsunami will never catch us. Why can't we have moved somewhere like Nebraska or Georgia or North Dakota? But no, we just had to move to California where there's wildfires and tsunamis. Come on, we have to go. I am not leaving. We literally just got here and I haven't even gotten my tan yet. We have to go or else we will all die. No, my tan is worth it. And if that tsunami wants to come for me, let it come for me. A few moments later. Oh my goodness, what happened? Does that sign say Japan? I'm from California. Did I really get carried across the Pacific Ocean? Look at this. There is a whole boat on top of my house. Like, how does that even happen? The whole town is gone. Wait, is that a Walmart over there? How is Walmart still open? Look, I hate to make this all about myself, but can someone get their butt in a boat and come out here and pick me up because I am not about to swim in this nasty ocean? Are you partying during the purge? What? I can't hear you over the music. There's something about a Walmart snack aisle that just, mm, it just hits the spot. So now I can get all of it for free. <laughs>
Oh my goodness, someone set my school on fire. That is so shocking. I cannot believe it. I wonder who did it. Who are you calling? Oh, I'm calling my ex to see where they are right now. But why? Because I just wanted to test my new karate skills on someone. Why is there like a hundred people at our front door? <laughs> Let's just say there's a lot of people that hate me. Y'all, I am locked out of my house. What do I do? Rob a bank. I've always wanted to know what it felt like to drive on the wrong side of the road. So here's my chance. Wake up. Wake up. Wake up. Oh my goodness. What? <gasps> Did Santa come? No, the purge started. Oh, I'm gonna go back to sleep now. I'm gonna work on my hit list. A hurricane's Wait, coming. Wait, what's the name of it? Hurricane Elsa. <gasps> Just like the Disney princess? Yes. Uh, I can't wait to meet her. When is she coming? I don't know. Does anybody else kind of want to go inside of a hurricane? No, because you could die. Okay, but do we really know that? Yes, we do. Now, come on. We have to go. Okay, fine. I just think we're missing out on a huge opportunity. No. A hurricane's coming? I have to go home and pack my stuff. I am not getting my clothes wet. <gasps> my kids. Where are my kids? We have been driving for five hours trying to get away from this hurricane. And guess what? It is still behind us. I mean, that is fan behavior. But if I was a hurricane, I would want me too. So I can't really blame it. Hey, how are y'all doing? <laughs> how is the hurricane going to go through here and destroy every single building except for the school over there? I mean, that was the one building I wanted it to hit. To make a long story short, my house was the only one on my street that survived the storm. But I'm not mad. I hated my neighbors. I mean, they were roaches. As you can clearly see by exhibit A, my house is literally bent. Like, how does that even happen? You always told me how you thought the upstairs was too small. But now look at it. We don't even have an upstairs because the Hurricane Elsa... Uh-uh, I am not getting in that lake. Why? There could be sharks in there. Sharks live in salt water. No, there are freshwater sharks. I promise you. Oh my goodness, could y'all be quiet? It is literally 3 a.m. in the morning. I am trying to sleep. I am like so excited for summer camp. I am too. The only bad thing is that there's no air conditioning. Wait, what? Y'all don't have air conditioning? Nope. Did you bring a fan? No, did you? No, I didn't. No, no. I. Someone call my mom. I am not staying here. I don't want to go ziplining. Um, why? Because I could die. That's what makes it fun. I mean, the fear of the cable just snapping at any moment. I mean, that's what makes it. Who wants to go first? Oh, me! Y'all, this summer camp may be nice, but let me tell y'all what's not nice. These chicken nuggets, which taste like dried cardboard, and the lemonade, which tastes like rat pee. How do you know what rat pee tastes like? Whoa, don't ask questions. Whoa, is this your campfire? Yes. It looks like y'all are all gathered around doing some voodoo ritual. You wanna join? No, no thank you. I will just go back to my cabin. It's the best part of camp. I'm sure it is. I just wanted to say that I'm No, I'm breaking up with you. But I was about to break up with you. Um, I said it first. That is not how it works. Well, that's how it's gonna work because I am not letting anyone, especially you, break up with me, okay? I'm breaking up with you. I'm sorry, are you breaking up with me while I am driving a car? Yeah. Do you realize that I have full control over your life right now? What is that supposed to mean? All I am saying is that red light up ahead is looking very much green. I'm breaking up with you. Wait, why? I am literally beautiful, stunning, amazing, talented. One hour later. I am kind, I am smart, and I am funny. I mean, what is wrong with me? Your voice is annoying and your face is tiring to look at. Well, you must be blind and deaf. I mean, honestly, I didn't think you had that much in common with Helen Keller because my voice sounds angelic and my face is beautiful. So I'm breaking up with you. Okay. You aren't sad? No, I am not sad. I mean, I'm sad for you, but as for me, <laughs> I'll just go find someone new. Oh, there they are. Bye. Whoa, where am I? This van looks absolutely atrocious. You're getting kidnapped. No, the only thing that we need to be getting is some Clorox disinfectant bleach because this van looks like it came straight out of a nightmare. I hate to ask, but could we go through McDonald's? Wait, you're not scared? <laughs> no, this is like my fourth time being kidnapped. Wait, really? Yeah, everybody wants me. Wait, I'm being kidnapped? You shouldn't have climbed into my van. It said Amazon on the side of the van and I wanted my package. Are you falling asleep? Yes, this van is surprisingly comfy. Uh, why aren't you screaming? I mean, I was, but then I just got tired of that. I mean, screaming is just so annoying. Someone help us! 
This place is disgusting. I mean, if the kidnapper doesn't kill me, the diseases in this basement definitely will. Ooh, this is your house? Uh, yeah. This is nice. Remember when I said I was gonna call 911 and everything? Yeah. Just forget it. I'm just gonna call Pizza Hut and order a pizza. Give me your money now. Look, I don't know who lied and told you that I have money, but, but I don't. I mean, I am broke. I mean, I wish I did though. It is so boring in here. We should play some music. What's your favorite song? Ooh, I love the Jonas Brothers. You know what? Never mind. I like the silence. Look, if you're gonna kill me, at least have some music playing in the background. Are there any objections? Yes, I object. <laughs> really? Oh, no, not really. Then why would you say that? Um, this wedding is so boring. I had to spice it up. Why did you have to let your son play the kazoo at your wedding? Because he just sounds so good. Good? This sounds absolutely terrible. I'm so happy that she's found someone, but I'm oh just so- Oh my gosh, Kelly, we get it. You're single. Nobody wants you. Now sit down. We've had enough. Why are you wearing white? That is so disrespectful to the people that are getting married. Look, I had to find a way to make this wedding about me. Plus, I look amazing in white. I love the decorations. I love the interior design, but where's the cake? Did you even come here for the wedding? The only wedding that I came here for is the wedding that my taste buds are about to have with this cake. This place is so nice. How could you afford this? My fiance is rich. Well, does your fiance have a sibling? Are you really trying to get with someone on my hey, wedding? Hey. Don't judge me. I would like to say a few things today about the people that are getting married. Um, I wish someone wanted me. As much as y'all want each other. Are you okay? <laughs> I'm sorry. Someone just take the mic. I can't. Did I miss the whole wedding? Yes. Where were you? I accidentally slept in. Um, could y'all go back up there and do it again? I missed it. <laughs> could you stop crying in my ear? Like, you were literally sobbing all over me. Like, there are tears running down my face, and they aren't from me. They were loved by many, and they lived- Look, this funeral has been going on for 17 hours, and I don't think their life was that eventful, so can we just go ahead and wrap this up? This is really hard for me. I'm so sorry. Did you even know them? No, I didn't know them at all. I just- Funerals make me sad. They were kind, funny, and intelligent, and- No, 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 no. Everything that you just said was incorrect. This person was a roach, and they were a rat. I mean, y'all are saying rest in peace to them, but now that they're gone, I get to rest in peace. Why does their gravestone say loved by all? Because they were most certainly not loved by all. I mean, in fact, they were hated by all. I'm not gonna lie, this casket kind of looks hideous. I mean, it kind of matches what's on the inside, though.